Hey folks, uh, a lot of people ask me for a more specific shadow boxing routine, so I thought I'd make one for you guys. It's an audio file, I made a drum beat, and it's just me calling different combinations over top. It's basically inspired by the old boss rootin' uh, workouts. So just four simple combinations, jab, jab cross, jab cross hook, and jab cross hook cross. So one, two, three, and four. Uh, I know some, some gyms, they like four to be like an uppercut at the end, some people do it with a right hook at the end. If that's what you want to do, you go ahead and do it. Just follow along, do the combinations that I call, and I also added a sprawl in there, so the sprawl is just hands down, hips down, and pop back up into your stance. The key elements with this is just to keep moving. If it's too much, you can skip a combination, or you can skip a sprawl. If it's very easy for you, you can add a little bit. So if I say one, you can double up your jab. If I say two, it can be one, two, small step, and another two. Three could be one, two, and you can double up your hook at the end, or you can go body and head. Any combination, you can throw a punch to the body and you can double up the last punch to make it a little bit more interesting. If it's too hard with the sprawls, then when I say sprawl, just keep your hands up and move off to the side. So if I say two in a sprawl, instead of going jab, cross, sprawl, you just go jab, cross, step off. Three in a sprawl, same thing. Just move your feet instead, if the sprawls get to be too much. The, uh, the file has a uh, drum component in the background. The idea is just to kind of keep you moving. It's, I think it's three beats per second or something like that. It's just to kind of keep a tempo going so you can kind of work to something with that. Um, and it speeds up a little bit more at the end. The last 30 seconds are the hardest part. There's some more sprawls, the drums pick up a bit more. And the idea is just to try and kind of stay in time with that and just to kind of keep you motivated. So I'll just do a, a walkthrough real quick and then I'll give you guys a link down below where you can check out the file and we'll go from there. All right, folks, here we go. Make sure you keep your hands up, keep your chin down, keep moving all the time. Hands, head, or feet, something should always be moving. Try and do the sprawls if you can. If you can do them, just keep moving, keep your hands up. All right, we're starting in three seconds. Ready? And here we go, two, two, three, four, one, one, two, three, sprawl, two, four, two, one, one, three, sprawl, Two, four, two, sprawl, two, two, three, sprawl, 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 one. Remember, keep those hands up, keep moving around. Two, four, two, sprawl. Two, one, one, four, sprawl, sprawl, two, three, four, two, sprawl, two, two, three, four, one, one, sprawl, sprawl, two, sprawl, three, three, two, four, two, sprawl, two. All right, last 30 seconds, here we go, two, Sprawl, two, sprawl, four, sprawl, four, sprawl, one, one, two, three, four, sprawl, 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 and that's it. So as you can see, it's a, it's a pretty good workout. It's just short of three minutes. Um, if you do like three rounds, four rounds of that with the one minute rest, it's a 15 minute workout. Pretty quick. If you have a heavy bag, you can do it on a heavy bag if you like. If you like, I said, if you want to make it more challenging, you can add an extra punch each time. 
Uh, one thing I forgot to mention at the beginning is you can also do it as a soap paw. So you've done a couple rounds, you want to switch it up, you can do everything as a soap paw. Kind of helps balance everything out and makes it more interesting. So just a couple ideas you can add on to this to make it more challenging. Like I said, if it's too much for you, skip a sprawl, skip a combination. Just make sure you keep those hands up and keep moving. Even when it's just your head moving, your hands are moving, your feet are moving, something should always be moving. You shouldn't be completely still, even if you're tired. Get something moving, keep your hands up, okay? I hope you enjoy it. I'll put a link below so you can get the audio and you can just listen to the audio if you want. Uh, I'll put it on my SoundCloud, I'll put it on my website. And uh, it's gonna be free for now for the next couple weeks while everyone's in quarantine. After that, I'm gonna make a few more. I'll probably have them for sale on my website. But for right now, it's free. So I hope you guys enjoy it. And uh, thank you very much. I'll see you guys in the next video.